TGR. Hey everybody, welcome to our E3 2019 preview for the Sony press conference that does not exist as it of today. It probably won't even happen. It won't. It won't. I'm Sean. Wah, wah. I'm Rudy. And I'm Onyx. <laughs> Your boy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you got me on that one. Uh, feel free to jump into the timestamps to look oh, at the games that we are going to uh, talk about. We're going to try and get a little hyped here. This is just a little preview. What could they show us? What could they not show us? What do we want them to show us? <clears throat> it's E3, baby. Time of dreams. Baby. It's all about the dreams. You gotta, you gotta yes. hype it up, man. So, so Sony, no. Sony's not supposed to be at E3 this year. No, I, I really don't think they will. No. But we're doing this video just in case. At the last minute, they decide <laughs> Let's state, have a state of, of play. play. So we're doing it anyway. If they don't show up, screw them. But for now, <laughs> uh, we've got eight games we're going to go through. You can look in the timestamps, like I said. Let's kick off with three different games that have um, already been announced. We've, we've already seen, seen them. them. Mm -hmm. We know they're coming. We just don't know when. We don't even know if they're coming out on PS4. They, they need to come They on PS4. could be... Probably cross-gen, probably cross-gen. But we'll see. Let's gonna That's kick things off. compatibility, man. We'll start it off with Death Stranding. Hype. Hideo Kojima's it, next game. Yeah. Is he an important figure in the gaming industry? I mean, you could say he is. He kind of sort of, you know, created Metal Gear Solid, Zone of the Enders. Oh, yeah. Knots. Zone of the Enders. Aren't you playing that? I sure am. You talked about that in your login bonus video. Which right? you can check out if you become a Patreon person. A patron. <laughs> <laughs> more, more to come. Anyway, but yeah, H Hideo Kojima, his next big game, he got kicked off, he got fired from Konami, essentially. He got yeah. let go. He said, screw it, went to Sony, and Sony was like, hey, we'll help you. And boom, they Open made arms. a Kojima production, and now this is his first game. It looks like a walking simulator so far. I was going to say, are we excited for this? Because I'm, I, I was mean, at first. Right, right. Some of those, a couple, two or three trailers yes. that were all like story cinematic, cinematic yeah. was like, yeah. What is going to be the total Del mind Toro is in one of them holding a baby in yeah. the canister that thumps you up. Yeah. Like, yep. what the hell Mads is going Mikkelsen's on? Mads Mikkelsen's in this. Yeah. Yep. I mean, the game, I mean, I don't ha know. Well, like, the game. The game yeah. has potential. The, the story definitely has potential. Awesome. He's always done some crazy, bad shit stuff. Yeah, he really has. The Mass Effect 1 walking simulator out with the Mako <laughs> over the mountains. Yeah. I have Not no so idea. Much. I have no idea what to expect from it. I mean, he did so good with Metal Gear Solid 5. That game design was incredible. I mean, it was in terms of just straight up gameplay, pretty much perfect. Yeah. Like everything else that was flawed from that game was story and world like the level design. But gameplay wise, perfect. Yeah. Bring that in, give us some really interesting places to visit, and we may have like another classic in our hands. Possibly, man. I mean, I am on this. I think I'm on the same side as you. That like, I was totally hyped seeing all the trailers and everything that like led up to it. And now I'm kind of just like a little bit worried. Yeah. After like that extended trailer, that if it is a walking simulator and all you're doing is just <laughs> delivering packages. I, I doubt it because he said it was gonna be an action game from the get go. He said this is gonna be an action game that yeah. I want to make. So it, we haven't seen combat. We haven't seen gameplay besides walking. So. Maybe it's like UPS on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> Deliver these bodies, baby. I have no idea what the hell it's going to be, but I, I, I want to see more. I need to see more. So what what do they need to show us then? Gameplay. To... Gameplay. Like actual, for, for... not just walking. No, 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 for sure. Like during the Metal Gear Solid heyday when you had two, three, and four, like those games were kind of coming out back to back in so a way. So good. A few years apart. Um, the, he had these huge 10, 11 minute trailers for E3 where like he would show you like it was almost like a little Nintendo Direct <laughs> for that game where he would show you like tons of cinematics tons of like in game stuff that you could do yeah. but hidden as a cinematic and you're like oh everything you saw you could do that and it was like mind blown you know so do that again show us the crazy stuff that we can do in Death Stranding he's done it with every single game and I can see him doing it again for sure so that's what I need to see. Okay. I'm the same. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Cool. That's <laughs> Uh Next up is our E3 2018 game of show, Ghost of Tsushima. I thought it was Sekiro. No. God, I don't remember. I don't remember. Our Your Ola nominee was. was, but I won the bet. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Well, anyway. That Sunday. Ghost of Tsushima had an incredibly strong showing yeah, last it was, year. It looked really good. It, it was looked really so good. pretty. It In so fact, pretty. it's already drawing conclusions with Sekiro. With like, how is it going to play now that we've had oh, the yeah. first yes. ninja game? And you know, it's funny because now that I've played Sekiro, 
I can't imagine going down from like not down like not to say that Ghost of Shima would be a like downgrade. Difficulty? No, 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 no. In terms of like gameplay, oh. like the combat in Sekiro, you know, difficulty aside, it's precise. It's good. Yeah, it's like good. the clashing, the yeah. the parrying. So. Ghost of Tsushima showed us that, but at a much more slower pace. Yeah. Which means it could be a very different feeling game, which I'm all for that. Yeah. I just, I can't picture it in my head. Now I think of ninjas and, and samurai fighting each other, and I, I can't picture anything but Sekiro. So mm. maybe that's a lack of imagination on my part. I do want to see what Sucker Punch brings to the table. Um, and they have made good games. And I'm a fan of Infamous. I yeah. like that series a lot. Yep. So I... I don't know. It looks good for it's, sure. It's probably going to be more of an open world action game. Yes. Than I agree. Sekiro. Yeah. That's, that's what, what I'm lo- thinking. At least that's what it looked like. It's what it. Yeah, because yeah. it, it was the the fields. Of, I can't remember the fields of yeah, yeah, Osmo yeah. something or other. Osmosis. That sounds so I don't know. <laughs> I very, very Japanese sounding no, name. No, <laughs> <laughs> no but you're, Osborne you're, Plane. No, that's no. Final Fantasy Twelve or something like that. Anyway, it, it was. Uh, this huge environment, and then it funneled field. into, yeah. you know, smaller corridors, and then bigger again, and different yeah. enemies. And I really like that whole style of like, like you see them in the movies. It's like, you know, like a western, like a quick draw, like a yeah. 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 And uh, so that had a different vibe to it, and yes. also it doesn't have the some of the supernatural elements that you would find in yeah, at least so, so far. far, at least so far. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. They could always pull it out, but it doesn't. I don't think so. I think they're gonna stick to like feudal historical setting like yeah. actual you know not this fiction this is going to be a little bit more of a serious game for sucker punch is that what we're saying well yeah i guess because yeah. infamous uh, yeah I, it was infamous very comic was, booky it was yeah. a very comic book game so especially right. like the first two yeah like, yeah yeah the second one i, I mean the third one's i just don't know what to expect really like i i almost don't want an open world game because like open world's overdone i well yeah but like <sighs> kind of like how from software develops your games like sekiro where you have like branching paths branching levels and, and stuff but yeah. maybe make those levels bigger with more stuff to do yeah if they're gonna take the open world approach maybe make it objective based like i just i just want to open up a map and have like yeah. towers, yeah. icons yeah. and towers yeah. i want to do something list. different that in horizon right <laughs> <laughs> right right yeah. which Nailed is it. you know that, that's you know that's one of the reasons why we love from software games because they they add so much things to it and the mobility from Sekiro, like how are you going to move around in ghost of tsushima I, I feel like ghost of tsushima was such a strong showing last year if it comes back this year two things it needs number one a much shorter demo of a lot more of the gameplay right, to right. sell just here's what a little bit more doing? and yeah. then release date boom yeah. and have it come out this year oh, like man. this should be one of those games where it's just like we're going to tease you a little bit more it's coming out this year yeah. and then do a full blowout on it later in the year yeah i mean that'd be cool this, this should be sony's holiday game in my opinion i think i agree i mean i yeah 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 everybody's hot on sekiro yeah yeah Wait six months, throw it back out there as your holiday game, because you got to have something. It's gonna bring up the comparisons. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I was just thinking That's like the same thing the... that happened with Horizon and Breath of the Wild. It's yeah, but that was like game. that was like weeks apart. Yeah, yeah that was a yeah, completely yeah, yeah, yeah. that was way too close. I feel like you know if it was that close, you would have people going in two different directions, yeah. and it would literally be like, oh, I'm hardcore. I want Sekiro, or yeah, I want to yeah. have more fun. A cinematic while experience, per- maybe. Yes. With, uh, with I mean, it was just Ghost a beautiful. I'm looking forward to it. Like I said, I want to see what they do, and I love the setting anyway. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The fact that we're getting three freaking like Sekiro, Neo, two, and this, like, what the <laughs> hell? Okay, I'm but down. Yeah, I'm excited for it. I'm down. All right, and then the last, the third game in the list of games we've seen already, The Last of Us Part Two. And what what is there to say about that? I, My body's ready. I yeah, this is another game where I don't think I want to see very much more of it. No. A lot of the surprise. Sh- from the first game came from seeing everything play out granted they were they were really good about keeping things under wrap i mean the the introduction to last of us part one nobody saw they never showed us that during like trailers or anything at least not that i can remember Mm. and that was like you said very powerful stuff oh yeah oh yeah Uh, very like i i got emotional i'm pretty sure i might have shed a tear or two because i was just like gut punch we're not prepared for it yeah no no one was so I, I agree with you. The less I see of this game, the more the, you know, the more I'll probably enjoy it. I just want them to. I you, you guys have already heard my criticisms of the first game, and I really want them to learn from that. So, besides gameplay design, like Last of Us had a really solid story. That's what sold me on that game. 
So what do I want to see from this? More story? <laughs> no. <laughs> Better gameplay? gameplay? They've already shown us stuff, but they it, it, us almost, it almost but it almost fell for into the... Yes, yes, yes. But it almost fell into... And sorry if it sounds like I'm not a believer. Take. No, no not really. No. It, it, it almost looked 1. too 5. fake. No, 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 no. It almost looked too fake. I oh, yeah, too... yeah. We, we, I remember commenting yeah. like, oh, she's dodging those arrows. And like, Some it just stuff it in felt there, a little like, too scripted. scripted. Thank you. That's a yeah, 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 yeah. So I want to I wanna see something that looks less scripted. I don't care if it looks janky or whatever. Yeah. Like, I just want to see what I'm going to experience in the game. Because Last of Us 1, I saw a lot of jank. You know, so, especially with the AI looking all weird and stuff. They're not going to show us that really realistically. They're not going to. So do you, do you want like, uh, what is it? Uncharted 4, the demo that yeah. they had oh, with oh their PS4 crashed? I would love that. I would love that because. <laughs> because that would be like. Is, I know, I know. They it's probably. Like, they probably. That showed fix me. That oh, that's issue. a real game. No, but I don't want to. Because they're going to. I don't want to see any more either. Pieces. Yeah. I don't want to see any more either. Like, I feel like mm -hmm. there is. We know enough of the gameplay. If Even if it was scripted or not. Like, I feel like it served its that's purpose. That's the basis of what the what you're going to get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, I just, I kind of don't want to see any more. I just want the game. And you, they're going to show us more. They're probably going to show us the reveal of Joel because we haven't seen Joel yet. He's probably old. Well, we have. We haven't. Yeah. Not in game, but this initial yeah. cinematic reveal. Oh, yeah. He like walked into the room and she's there playing the guitar. Yeah. We, we got it. Right. Go. But we haven't seen him like, I, we don't know how early that was versus what we saw now. Because it's like that a little like bit of a, time skip. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. I don't know. But I do want to see more of Joel. So that'll probably be the last you know, thing we see. You know, it's yeah. funny. Two of those three games, we basically said we don't really want to see a whole lot yeah. more. And yeah. maybe that's why Sony said maybe we shouldn't come. Because they realize they don't, more they don't want to show more of those until maybe right when they're closer to release. Yeah. Yeah. Like, this comes out next week. That and also gives you the idea, though, that Sony doesn't have a lot of the pipeline. They, yes, they're working on the PS5. Yeah, right. Probably working on the but, PS5. I mean, that's, and they're that's probably, hard. They have two different departments. They have, but hold on. What? Before we like get into that, like as the PS5 with a whole bunch of launch games that come out, they probably are just like, let's go ahead and have this because we know it's going to come out on the PS4. Yeah. And let's Cross let's keep everything that is going to come out on the PS5 secret. hidden and secret yeah. for the time being. They're pulling a Nintendo, I would like to say. I suppose. Yeah. They're Nintendo keeping their cards the, close. They're, yeah. they're not yeah. they're not pulling a Square Enix and being like, hey, here's a game, <laughs> but it's gonna come out in 15 years. <laughs> or here's Elder Scrolls Six. See you in 10 years. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously. Here's a title card. Enjoy. Nintendo did that once for Metro Prime Four. And Animal. Well, yeah, no, that was not a really few years Crossing, ago. But. That was literally 2014. I think we're no Metroid Prime Four. No, 2015. Then oh, no, that no, no, was no. 2017. No. You're right. What's you're the right. matter with you? Sorry, guys. Sorry. Good no. grief. Go drink some coffee. All yeah. right, let's move on. Seriously. Uh, so, so those are the three games we know. We got five games left. Know. None of these <laughs> games we know exist today. Although, I would dare say They're at least these next. Well, They're at least the <laughs> four of the five are definitely going to happen. <laughs> Yeah, these are definitely these in dreams. development, but we haven't seen them yet. Because right. you know they're going to make them. So let's start with uh, the one that's probably least likely to be shown of these three, just because it just came out not too long ago, Spider-Man 2. The sequel yeah. to Spider-Man, which came out in last, last quarter? Year. Fourth quarter of last year? Yeah. It was September? Maybe late late quarter three? Yeah. Um, wow, that was a great game. That was a surprise uh, for me. Easy easy to make a sequel yeah oh, yeah they are totally I mean, oh, 100 they left it wide open yeah and wide it sold open. really well i think it was the best selling spider-man game ever I yeah think. because it, you feel like spider-man it, it's funny i was so skeptical of this game before <laughs> we went in i'm like oh man it looks like another arkham game and I, i'm not a fan of the arkham games sorry and yeah, so. um but i played it and i was like oh this doesn't feel like the Arkham games. This feels better. I feel more mobile. I feel more in control of my character. I love it. You feel like Spider-Man. Yeah, yeah. You feel like Spider-Man. Anyway, I liked it a lot. It's a good game. I want a sequel. This, they could, with Spider-Man 2, they need to bring out the villains sooner, which I think they can because they right. spent enough of Spider, the first game, yeah. really developing... Doc Ock. It was a Doc well, Ock origin story. Well, it was, but it was yeah. also a... Spoiler. Peter Parker is uh, late. He's he's been Spider Man for a while. Right. Yeah. Correct. So he we had to relearn what's going on in this version of it. Right. From his perspective. Him and Mary Jane already <laughs> split up. Yeah, like <clears throat> it, it's it, it's weird because it, it's not a Spider Man origin story. Not at all. It's a Doc Ock origin story. Exactly. But then like you it it takes a lot of stuff from the different Spideys that we already know. Right. Yeah. And makes this like amalgamation of of. Spider-Man, I don't know. I like I liked it a lot. And I enjoyed the heck out yeah. of it, and I played the DLC, um, all three of the DLCs that yeah. came out. Um, 
and they developed Miles very little, but I would love to see. Oh, he's more of I thought Miles. he got a decent amount of development. Well, you play as him for, uh, for yeah, a couple, tip, a couple and different times. You see a times. lot of his. It, I mean, he wasn't Peter Parker levels of no, focus, no. but enough for me to be attached to the character, and definitely one in the sequel where you're going to be playing as him with his different set of moves. That's what I'm saying. Him. Like, I would love oh, to yeah. see that in the next. And, and, and even I, I appreciate that even more so now in hindsight because I watched um, Into the Spider Verse, uh, yeah. which is a M- Miles Morales is the main Spidey. Man, you guys first. You guys I need to watch see it. it. I know. Yeah. Watch it if I, you I haven't see seen it. it internet, see it. it is. It won an Oscar uh, for a reason. Maybe yeah. so. Maybe Miles should be the main character of Spider-Man Two. I would love. That. I would take that. That's 100%. probably how they should like, do it. That should be his origin story of him figuring out. Because like the way that like the DLC has like his character coming in, it's like, oh, I want to go ahead and I want to do this. Oh, I went ahead and calculated the right way to go ahead and have my web shooters fit my wrists and all this and that. Yeah. And Peter Parker's like, oh, I totally underestimated you throughout like <laughs> this entire time. Yeah. And like they're making jokes, and then like at the end, it's like, okay. I have enough time after like fighting Hammerhead to finally like teach you, and then it just boop. That's so yeah, it. so I think up. they're setting they're it up. Setting they're for totally. Miles will be the, so that's great. I would love that. I would yeah. love like an origin story, and then like kind of like playing like multiple missions with like different with Peter Parker and one Miles Morales and the other I one. I see that happening. That's for that's sure. probably still a couple years out. But I want two. it. At least two. I know. At least, At least two. two. But that could be a PS5 launch title. It could be. Don't tease me, Onyx. Uh, <laughs> what what actually yeah. might have a better chance of being a launch window title just because of the gap between like release. Months, it? It, well, so six okay, months six better months chance. Yeah. Uh, God of War 2, which Ragnarok, we also know is here. coming. Ragnarok? Ra- that's Man, that's what it's going to be. Ragnarok. Yeah. Well, you, 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 we all played it, right? Yeah. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert for the yeah, end of spoiler God of War. Alert. Thor, baby. It's oh, going to be called Ragnarok. They built it up that whole time. And that was freaking Loki. Oh. Yeah. yeah, Loki is. His, that yeah. it was Loki the whole time. Yeah. It was like, oh. But I wonder how far they're. I should have known that. that as soon as they were talking about him being from um, whatever the blue world. World. The was. realm. Yeah, I can't it, like, remember. I, I, I don't know my Norse mythology <laughs> as well as I thought I did. But like, it, it was a good twist. It just made me think like, wait, so Loki is like the brother of Thor in Norse mythology, like right. Are they gonna stick to that? Like, so are they gonna Thor... find out? Well, wait a minute. He was the son of no, he was of, son of Kratos of... and the giant, which was the mom. She was right. a giant descendant. Right. So that's probably we... not. No, because he was adopted. Oh, in the MCU. Oh, Loki. <laughs> oh, yeah. my God. oh God. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, I thought in Norse mythology he was the actual brother of Thor. I could be wrong though. So, because I mean, in God of War he's not, and in the MCU he's not. But whatever. So what was the name of the head? The head character? In God of War? Yeah. He walks around um, with you. He's on your hip the whole oh, time. Oh, G- G- uh, G- 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 Gamir? Oh, my God. He needs Mimir, to come Mimir, back. Mimir, thank you. Yeah. Mimir, yeah. One yeah, of yeah. the best Amazing. parts of that. Hilarious. Seriously. Just like a talking head. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's how you do a teaser for God of War 2 is just Mimir talking. <laughs> that's it. I don't know what he'd be like, talking I've about. I've got a tale to tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how they should do it. And I really think, like, I, again, again, this is just, I always say this. I want these developers to learn from their past mistakes. Look oh, at yeah. what people criticize, like, Look into it and see how you can improve your game. I don't. I, I would like more of the same because I did enjoy the story it that much. It was so good. But the there are. Combat. Yeah, no. The, 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 the climbing. The, oh no, that was me. I hate oh. the climbing. What did you hate the climbing? The too? rowing load times. No, that was no. the climbing load times. Rowing was yeah, it was probably loading. <laughs> stuff, yeah. Whatever. I enjoyed it for what it was. No, I loved it. I, the game. I I went in with no expectations. I had pretty low ones myself, and I like I got to the end. I enjoyed the game for sure. Oh yeah. Um, but the story was cool. Lack of the enemy design, point. lack of bosses, like you fight the same troll like okay, fair. ten times. There's really only three major boss fights: the stranger, the dragon, and the stranger again <laughs> at the end, which is Balder. Oh, and the and then when you fight the brothers, like yeah. So really, you have like four big encounters. Compared to like God uh, of War 2, there's like, a dragon in this game. I said the dragon. Yeah, did you? Yeah, he yeah. did. Oh. Anyway, I don't know. I mean, I, 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 I enjoyed it. You know what game had really good combat though, but I couldn't get into the story. Transition. 
Horizon, baby. So Horizon <laughs> 2, I think, would be the most likely of those three. Oh, yeah. Only because that had come out a whole like, full year before. Yeah, yeah. They've already... Oh, my God, I forgot. It's, it's been two years. So somebody already it's, said that they're working on the second yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, they did. The voice yeah, actor? Yeah, sure. Was it the VA? I don't know who it was, but I did it's, read that. It's been over two years. So yeah. if that game's coming out next year... Horizon 1 done. We could see that. Although, the realistically, all three of those games, they got to be holding them back for the PS5. You really think so? Yeah. I mean... We may see hell it. Hell of a launch window, I'll tell you that much. Well, I mean, when you launch that. with, like, Mario and Zelda in the same year... That's true. Like... And, and arguably some of the best ones in their franchises. That's yeah. Very true, very true. I'm Dude, just if saying. that was the trifecta of the PS5's launch year, That's like the first year... crazy. With those other three kind of coming out as cross-gen titles... That'd be crazy. There you know. go. You just locked in it's your... Like, uh, yeah, like, oh, Sony, we don't have games? Well, here you go, mofos. Here's Excuse some me. sequels, baby. Although then they'll, then they'll have nothing... Actually, no, that's not true. No. Well, hang on. Before we go on. So, Horizon 2. Yeah. What? I didn't even finish the first Yeah, one, I didn't though. finish it. So you guys I suck. Know. Like I said, I, I <laughs> yeah, actually you, really... You guys both look, suck. I enjoyed the combat. I really did. I just... I wasn't pulled into the story. I felt like it this was... This is... Internet, this is the guy that when we talk off camera, he's always like... I prefer gameplay over story any day. Absolutely. Yep. All the Absolutely. time. Absolutely. But All the time. while the gameplay was good, I'm also tired of open world design. And this game didn't do anything different from open world design. It was I don't care. Another open world game. <laughs> I don't care. And honestly, you play would, Final Fantasy 15. I would rather play Breath of the Wild. You didn't like Final out. Fantasy 15. What a loser! I sure didn't. Well, I did. I like it. Was an okay. It was game. okay for what it was. But, Chapter 13. But Ugh. anyways, just, let's continue. I was playing Breath of the Wild at the same time. Like you really think I was? And gonna... I, I don't blame. And you. that was gameplay over story a hundred million times. But far <laughs> yeah, better gameplay. Yeah, because the story was It was great. Just exactly. Completely... <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> that game was like play me. And Horizon is like listen. Okay, to so me. so if anyway. if there's okay. this, if they do a state of play, which they won't, and if Horizon <laughs> Two happens to show up, which it won't, which it won't, <laughs> what what needs to be in this for you I to be excited? No idea. For me to be excited without spoiling the end of the game because we haven't seen it. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, I listen. To be honest with you, I don't care. I'm not gonna go back. And I probably Horizon. won't either. Okay, spoilers okay. for Horizon. Okay. You guys aren't going to go back? I probably aren't going to go back. Okay, all right. So the way that it ends is the way that everyone would expect. You know, she's some special chick, and she has all these powers and blah, blah, blah. Wow. Um, I that. Yeah, I know. Very original. But they leave it wide open in the sense that, that the guy that was helping you throughout this entire time to go ahead and track everything. Is he the bad guy? Yeah. Whoa! Essentially, he's the bad guy. So um, it kind of like opens up a little bit because there's the so much. No, I don't. You've never met the guy. All right, oh, cool. I don't remember him. All right, cool. Awesome. Um, so <laughs> He played more than me. I played like 30 hours. <laughs> wow. I just ran around and killed stuff. The yeah. guy that like hacks into your, like, your comm thingy. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's yeah. ringing a bell. Yeah. He, he was... Uh, <laughs> Do you guys ever watch... Oh, my God. I forgot what the show. He's an actor. He's like a TV actor. Uh, oh, that guy. Yeah, you don't, uh, you don't know what I'm talking about. Anyways, they left it wide open in that sense that like you go ahead and you save the village and you save the world from zero dawn. And they leave it wide open because the guy's like, oh, uh, there's more stuff. And, you know, kind of screw her over. So, so is she a space? No, wayfarer? no, no. Well, she's the descendant of her mother and her mother went ahead and <laughs> like, so. <laughs> of, of like, it's like a great, 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 great grandmother. And oh, she like, yeah, goes, yeah, she yeah. has the DNA and she has like all the facial replica, whatever. Would that... you say she's the one? No. Oh, she sounds like- Because the one the is one. nothing but code. Damn, that's deep. <laughs> Anyway, I have no idea what they're talking about. Go watch about right John now. Wick 3. <laughs> Spoilers? <laughs> what the He's talking about The Matrix, but Keanu Reeves, whatever. Oh, oh now I got, I got the connections. I wow. Five. High five. <laughs> anyway, guys, Horizon 2 ain't happening. Horizon no. 1 dawn. Okay. But, no, but it, I'm not hyped it, for What it at I all. would like to see as far as gameplay is better stealth mechanics. Because, like, yeah. by the end of the game, you are so powerful that you didn't even need to be You stealthy. didn't even need to be stealthy. Also, just better go, melee. <laughs> the melee sucks. Yeah, the melee was kind of weak. Oh, my God. It was kind of weak. It was um, awful. I, I mean, granted, you know, the main part of the game <laughs> was the bow and arrow. And for the sure. different, like, mechanics that opened up with, like, different. So you know, give it melee options, make it more. more she had a staff that she'd stab. Yeah, and you press R one and you go, and that's pretty much it. <clears throat> but with the arrow, I mean, you have so <laughs> many things that you can do. Yeah, like, yeah with the arrow, you had a lot. There, there was a lot of things that you can do. It was, it was cool. Um, and I don't know. To be honest, I like my games with big cat-like griffin things. So yeah, like Super Mario 3D World. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 
She doesn't like my transitions. He doesn't like That was great. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, now I get it. All right, so... So, Team Eco... Ico... Eco... Eco. Is now... Gen, Gen Design. Gen Design. <coughs> right, Fumito Oeda disbanded from... He left Sony and created Gen Design. So, we're, assu we're putting this here because we assume whatever he's going to make next will be exclusive to Sony. Yep, yeah, sure. We'll and they will probably help him publish it. Assume it's assumptions. The it's been two years? 2016. Three years, two and a half years since The Last Guardian. Yeah. It had been uh, 12 years. No, 2000 and... Oh, wait, was four. it? Four. No, it wasn't oh, four. Oh, we mean since Shadow of the Colossus. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it meant since it was announced. I was like, no, no, no. So it was, it was 10, so it's been a hot 11, minute. 12. It was 12. I got it right the first time. You did. Dang. You did. That was meant to be a joke. Well... It's been 12 years pri prior to The Last Guardian. They got to come out with something faster. But knowing sure. them, I could see this still being another two, two and a half years away. Yeah. This? I mean, uh, he, the guys? This? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Well, it depends on what he's doing. We don't know. I, I, got, I sincerely don't think it, it's going to come out that fast. He, he's with the, the oh, you think it's going to be longer. Oh, yeah. They're oh, gonna, no, if no, anything, no. they're, they're going to show it at like the PS5. Shorter. No. Yeah, I got no it. They're going to show it at like the PS5, a PS5 like, game for sure. highlight reel of like, oh, these are the games that are coming out. And then it's going to be like either the end of PS5's generation or the PS6. I don't know, man. Like, I think he learned from his lessons. I mean, he, he was definitely being very ambitious way too early. The... the the tech the wasn't there. The PS3 uh, wasn't there. Right. The tech was not right. there. And right. the touché. AI was... It's, what he was, was going for wonky. was really ambitious. Like, Hopefully maybe, it. Like, with a PS5, maybe he could have done it. Huh? <laughs> Nothing, man. I'm just salty over the AI in that game. <laughs> it wasn't even that bad. Anyway. The last Guardian was, hey, go here. You think you think <laughs> <laughs> that was true, though. That's literally what, ha what happened. Oh, God. Oh, okay, all right, all right, all right. I digress. I digress. Yeah, I just the guy's a, a visionary. he's a visionary. So that's what I want. I just I just need to see what he wants to make. So so yeah. if you could choose what he made, Shadow of the Colossus two. No, yeah, I don't I'm want right that. there. I, do I don't want, want that. that. I want it. There's yeah. no way either he's that replicate or replicate that though. You're not gonna get the same feeling you did with the first one. You Why already not? know. What I it bought is. the game like, three times and because, I enjoyed it every because single time. The game is good. Yeah, a Shadow of the Colossus two. Why like what is new about that? Why did they go ahead Nothing. and cut off this area? <laughs> Why did how did Dorman get into those colossi? Yeah, that's not a Shadow of the Colossus game. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Look, dude. Like, you don't want to write aggro again? I mean, like, I would love to write aggro. Again. Well, well, there you like, go. But it doesn't have to go around wander, and it no, I know that. I know that. But like, like, it's just to build the world. Yeah. What if there's other demons there in are. this world? They, sure there data are, yeah. miners have looked into Shadow of the Colossus, and they found I think it was like four to six other colossi that were that never released. Well, but they were never game for a reason. But like, what if there yeah, were like production in times. other areas of the world, like for completely rushing the distant game. lands? I think it was rushed. That game, yeah, they cut it because of like trying to get it out. Oh, either way, point is this. Trust me, I've looked into it. <laughs> Shadow of the Colossus is an amazing experience, but you can't. I'm sorry, it's really hard to 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 strike gold twice in the same spot. I don't, I don't know how the saying goes. Lightning struck twice in the same bottle. I don't fucking. From but, software does it all the time. But they change their stuff up. So they change up Shadow of the Colossus too. How? Let Fumito wait to figure well, it out. Prove me wrong, Ueda. <laughs> he can do prove it. Prove me wrong, clearly. But yeah, I just want to Maybe you ride Trico into battle on the flying Oh, my God. <laughs> Maybe you are Trico and you're Ooh. fighting Sha and Colossi. Dude, you guys are... never beat like Last Guardian. Like The stuff that happens in that What story, if you are like... the Colossus? Anyway. <laughs> now, now he's just grasping for ideas. I just want to see what he does. You are aggro. <laughs> you are aggro. <laughs> you fall. You're the princess. First person you look at. Spoilers. You're aggro. <laughs> Nay. Spoilers for a 15 year old. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I got this slow. All right, let's just move on to okay. the dream. This so, is okay, it. Okay. Final game coming up to conclusion. This is it, baby. This is what you've been waiting for. Yeah, so last year. We thought we were getting Bloodborne 2 in this little title you may have heard of called Daracene. Oh, yeah. But yeah. Daracene was not Bloodborne 2. Definitely not. No, it had a throwback to Bloodborne 2. It oh, very yeah, much looked dolls. like it. It looked like a prequel. Doll. And yeah. the doll. They had like, the doll in there and stuff. Uh, that would be really cool to see if 
in Bloodborne 2 instead of a sequel necessarily, which I think would work. Yeah. A prequel, The Fall of Yarnum. That would actually, yeah. yeah. Bloodborne, The Fall of Yarnum. There, there's your game. Yep. Come on, FromSoft. Yep. Come on, Kamiya. Oh, wait, Kamiya. Not Kamiya. Kamiya. Miyazaki. Sorry. Wow. You, you, know, you know what the crazy thing is? Is that you just said <laughs> The Fall of Yarnum, and to go back to Shadow of the Colossus 2, The Fall of Dorman. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I digress for real this time. Okay, so Bloodborne 2, I, I don't want a sequel to that. I would. I want it, like the gameplay, but because like I, 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 and I could be wrong, but I feel like all of us we thought that Sekiro was going to be Bloodborne gameplay, which it's not. It's faster. It's fast, like Bloodborne. It's faster, but it's different. Way it's different. Than Bloodborne. And and much different. <clears throat> but I don't know. Like I feel like. Cthulhu and like everything that like no I want those monsters because it's hard to strike gold twice man it. it's just like <clears throat> you're, we... Dark Souls 3 was a decent game Dark Souls decent. 2 was poo poo ka -choo. actually I would say more than decent Dark Souls 3 was a good game I enjoy Dark I Souls, really enjoyed Dark Souls 1 was but the, the thing best is, in but, my but opinion but the thing is Dark that. Souls 3 also held on to Dark Souls 1 so much half of the game was a callback to Dark Souls 1 they don't... and that's oh, what yeah, happened the with the fall of Yarnum and that well, would happen with Bloodborne. I feel like, like there's a lot of story to tell there, though. But there sure is. There yeah. is a lot of story to tell. But that the way that that first, the first freaking time you play that game and you realize it's freaking aliens, like, it's hard to replicate. And I just don't want it for the sake of, like, I want more of it. I want them to really do something crazy like that again. Because that, that, that shit blew my mind. Like, yeah. when, when I realized it was actual aliens and you see that, like, happen in this world, I'm like, wow, this is actually genius like bloodborne is not a piece of art hands down so for them to make bloodborne 2 it's it's gonna it's not it's not gonna feel as genuine look, in my opinion look when terminator came out it was a fantastic film when alien came out piece of art and then you get terminator 2 and aliens yeah, 2 but it's terminator. bloodborne 2 bloodborne, bloodborne is not terminator bloodborne is like the fourth uh, game they've made mass effect 2 in a series like this that. is this is the make no. it the mass effect 2 to mass effect the kingdom hearts 2 to kingdom hearts no. Bloodborne 2. I prefer Aliens 1 to Aliens 2. When... And that's okay, because Aliens yeah, 1 okay. is a horror movie no, they're, versus yeah, an they're action. They're very different, different movies. Yeah. Same thing with Terminator and Terminator 2. One's yeah. an action movie, the other one's a freaking horror, like, sci-fi. Get it shot, whatever. <laughs> no, you are. <laughs> no, this would be hype. It would, no, uh, it would I, be. Honestly, we would it all would, be hype. We would all be hype. This, this would be, arguably, the biggest announcement of the show. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, thinking of all the different know, dreams Horizon that could happen. Horizon 2. Uh... <laughs> and when I say the show, I mean E3. Like, this year, yeah, Blood, yeah. If Bloodborne Two shows up at E3 this year, yeah, I don't huge. Know. There could be there could be another one coming up with some dinosaurs in it. But we'll yeah, save that for yeah. the next talk, baby. Baby. Oh, maybe that's their new game, Prehistoric Souls. <laughs> oh my. Kill dinosaurs. Dude, no, souls, Prehistoric dude. Souls would be awesome. That actually would be kind of cool. Cause they there's a dinosaurs. lot of horror with. Dinosaurs? Prehistoric creatures. Yeah, it's scary as shit. Yeah. In the wild, you see a big old velociraptor coming your way. Oh, hey, yeah. How are you going to shield that bad boy? Dude, where, where, no, 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 no. No, seriously. Now I'm really excited about <laughs> prehistoric stuff. <laughs> but that's not Bloodborne 2. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> Enter the Jurassic period. Yeah, that's that's from software. We're just talking Sony, so Bloodborne 2. Where's the harmonica? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. All right. That was a... <laughs> That was a good discussion. I don't know what to expect. I don't, I don't know think they're going to show up at all. But if they do, they're showing up because they have stuff uh, to show. That's, I mean, obviously. I would hope so. But, yeah. And they do have at least three games to show us now because they've already shown it to us That's, today. A, that's a five the minute tent state bowl. of play. <laughs> yeah. Look at the games we've already talked about. Yep. Here's a new one. So what did you guys think about that list of games? Did we forget anything? Yeah. Is there anything, if Sony shows up, that you would be incredibly hyped to see? Please let us know. Legend of Dragoon. Wikipedia that one, baby. <laughs> <laughs> All you youngins. Yep. Oh my gosh. Because yeah, we're older millennials, apparently. <laughs> Wait, we we're are. not Gen Xers. We sure aren't. No. Anyway. All thanks right. for watching, guys. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed. E3! Woo! 2019. Let's go. Okay, bye. Like what you saw? Check out some of our other videos. Be sure to click the subscribe button, hit the little bell, and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for your support, and thanks for watching.